What's this mic? Alright, there we go. Um, graphics. Set up. Enable on track, on track, uh, ray tracing at 60 frames per second. Sure, we'll go performance sound good to me. Narrator, one of seven, value selector, off, one of two. I don't know what any of this stuff is, at all. Heavy driving assistance, heavy driving assistance, driving approach rule for everyone. It includes assistance, it's braking, steering, help with cornering. Um, I don't think I want help with braking. at iconic cathedrals of speed. United by passion. Driven by competition. That's a sick Ferrari. Hey, what do we have to We are still looking good so far. Celebrate every second found and discover who we are at the limit. Welcome to a new era of motorsport. Welcome to Forza. All right. And I haven't played Forza since like the original on the original Xbox way back in the day. Alright, let's see how this is compared to the crew. So I'm supposed to be getting, uh, well obviously this is early access because I got the premium edition so we're getting to play five days early. And um, I believe we unlocked some other stuff too. some cars. Maple Valley is the perfect track to put the new Corvette E-Rate to its paces. It's not a race. You won't be alone out there, so keep an eye out for traffic. Here we go. Oh, man. The race line is your optimal path on track. When it's blue, be on the gas. When it's red, hit those brakes. Oh, off to a bad start early. I haven't played this game in so long. Oh my. I want to switch the view. Do I have to use this view? Oh, okay. There we go. There Break we go. Break before the turn. Coast through it. Then accelerate as you exit. So this is kind of like, uh... The crew with the handling. I mean, the view that works best for you, but always be looking as far ahead as possible. Yeah, that would have helped out a little earlier. Some of that first. So this is kind of like the crew with how it's got the, the uh, arrows on the road, but the cars handle a lot more realistic. Like, definitely more difficult. Gives me Gran Turismo vibes. I guess this is supposed to be Xbox's Grand Turismo. I guess that's what Ford's is. Alright, I'm trying to kind of get in the hang of this a little bit. I'm not the best uh, car gamer or gamer. 
but uh, you know, I'm getting better at it. Oh, you think I rewind in this too? Like in the crew? That's sick. I didn't know that. I had no idea that uh, Forza games had that. Ooh, oh, oh, oh no, that's an E. I'm so used to hitting that's the NOS the A button. That's a typical practice session with light traffic. Now let's see what the final laps of an that's endurance an e race is like against a full field of competition. Next right. stop, Akone, Japan. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm getting hyped. I'm getting hyped. <laughs> Graphics are sick. Graphics look really good. Handling very realistic feeling. It's not like you can just whip it around the corner. It's not like uh, Need for Speed, shall I say. Oh, come on now. Plenty of laps behind us and only a couple more to go. Just one last pit stop for fresh tires and you'll be in a great position for the final push. Cadillac. Dang. Oh, this thing's gonna be sick. Track is clear to the left. Get on it. so much lately it's just instinct to hit that NOS button. Let's go, let's go. Get out the way, get out the way buddy. Alright, here we go. About to catch him. Alright, put him back. Back there. Lap, lap. Finish strong. Car is sick with him. get a Viper. That's one thing we're going to definitely do in this game. I don't even know how it drives, but I want one. When you hit the other cards, it's kind of makes you feel like you're going to actually lose control of that whole shakes the screen kind of thing. Great, great. Terrific driving. It's a pretty neat little effect. Yeah, like other games, when you hit someone else's car, you just you see your car lose control, but they kind of like did that thing with the screen there. Makes it for, feel more realistic, like you are about to lose control. From open practice runs to thrilling wheel-to-wheel -wheel races, that's just a small sample of what's ahead. Ready to begin your motorsport journey? Yeah. 
Is that my first car? Give me that Cadillac. For your new racing Wait, am I a chick? Mm, yeah, switch. Here we go. You can come back later to try something else or to check out what's new. Okay. What do we want to wear? Let's see what we got. We got a lot of different suits you can choose from when you start. Let's see. Black, purple, gold. I don't really care too much about this, but since it is a new game, I'll go through these real quickly. You gotta see what there is to choose. But you gotta see what's in the store. Well, I think I'm gonna get that one. I'll probably get that red one. Oh, I changed my mind. I'm gonna get this one. All right. Yeah, and achievements already. A car's journey from the showroom floor to the winner's circle is the culmination of a thousand little decisions. Every part, every detail, all carefully chosen by great builders who know what it takes to push a car past the hell its limitations, to find that extra tenth of a second, and in the process, create something that is a Just unique gross. extension of themselves. Super nice. Your car's journey begins here. To become a Builder's Cup champion, you'll need to outsmart and outbuild your opponents before battling it out wheel to wheel on race day. All right. I don't want that Subaru. Don't tell me I gotta start with a Subaru. I got the premium edition. Premium edition. For our first premium series, car. We have a few cars for you to choose from. Each is a great starting point for you to build. So pick the one that speaks to you. Uh, no. No. Oh, come on. Seriously? So I started with a Mustang in the crew, so I guess I'll do it again Mustang here. Mustang is the original pony car and an American icon. This GT model is both beauty and beast, channeling raw V8 power through its rear tires for impressive lap times. Okay. Can't wait to take this to the track. So I'm starting with the same Mustang I started with in the crew. Great. I thought I was going to have some unlock cars. the possible racing experience by adjusting the difficulty and rule set. As your racing skills evolve, try raising the difficulty to earn even more credits to buy other cars. Okay, this is a lot like, uh, this is a lot like the crew. Because the difficulties you can adjust, uh, as you go along in the crew, so. Same thing here, different layout, but pretty similar. Alright, I'm gonna keep it there for now, just to get the hang of it. your car handles. I've set a target lap time for you. If you struggle to achieve the lap time, consider changing the difficulty settings before the race. Now let's get after it. Why you tune your car? Tuning is all about making small incremental changes to a car's setup, testing them out on track during practice and dialing it in. Some upgrade parts include more tuning options, giving you even more control over your car's performance. I'm not messing with that. I have no idea what I'm doing in there yet. Like I said, I haven't played one of these realistic racing games since like Forza back in the day. It's gonna be a heck of a lot different. Practice is a critical part of any race event where you hone your skills with your latest build on the track you'll be racing. 
As you practice, you earn credits and we'll be tracking your lap times to see how you match up against the competition before the race. speed in the crew when you play this game, it is definitely a lot harder. Alright, let's try out the pits, see how this goes. I don't know why I pulled in here, I think I'm good. The tires are still good, right? Yeah, or not, but we'll find out. Work. 
Feel free to end practice at any time or continue running hot laps until the session times out. I think I'm doing practice. That was a practice. That was a I did not do good. Session. Now it's time to race. Oh, they said I did great. If that was great, then uh, we're golden. I got plenty more of that in me. Plenty more handling experience. Handling experience from the crew. Not working. Uh, where are we going? Let's go to go to race. This is the only car I got. I thought I was going to get more for premium. Full on. Alright, my first race. First race, guys. First race, official race. Oh, hang on one second. the only one who gets like this ghost pitch when I'm playing racing games like the same spot every time I'm playing a racing game. Random pitch. Another achievement. not too bad after you, you know, get a couple laps and it's, you get the hang of it pretty easily. It's just definitely got that more realistic vibe for sure. Alright, first place. Let's hold it. Hold it steady. I could follow these arrows a lot better though.
and these tires are getting worn out. These tires are definitely getting worn out. Second, blew the doors off them. Points earned after every race will determine our overall series standings. Ending the series at the top of the leaderboard means that trophy is ours. All right, not bad so far. I think the game plays, you know, pretty much um, as advertises for you know more realistic car driving, and it feels like it. Graphics are sick. The the handling the feels event number one in the books. Good showing out there today. Good. You're into the realistic stuff. Um, graphics are crazy, though. Yeah, that looks crazy. Credits earned 12,800. Ooh, I got 562,800 already. As our car levels up, we'll unlock new parts that we can use to increase vehicle performance. Okay. You know, lock rim sizes, tire width, and all that. Okay. We're ready all to right. head out for our next event. I just want to exit out and see what else there is. Is that where I'm at right now? Was in this mode? Okay, so that'd be continue. Let's see if they got online mode. VIP. Oh, so I got the 2019 Honda. Oh, what is that? A Veloster? Veloster. Veloster. We're going to call it a Veloster. Front wheel drive car. So uh, that's something you get with the VIP. I got a Subaru Forester. Okay. I mean, Forza Edition, not a Forester. <laughs> Heck yeah. Ooh, we got the Camaro too. Okay, we got the AMG. And we got the gold. Okay. Black racing suit with the gold pattern. Okay. Purple. Oh, these are all VIP. All right, I didn't know that. Now I know. I didn't really read the details on what comes in the VIP. Wow. Wow. This is cool. So, so I even got, I got all those cards and 500,000 credits. 
for the VIP package. So if you guys got the VIP package, then you guys are going to be happy with that. <sighs> Another car, 2018 Subaru, uh, Flux, Lavar, Lavari. Wow. Another one? But I was getting mad. I didn't think we were going to get anything. So many cars. Right, am I gonna actually own these cars or gonna buy these? Wow. The accuracy. Oh, that Look at that thing. It's 1974 freaking old school like indie car. Okay. So let me go to my car. My car. So these Here's are my cars. The cars you own. Guys, so literally with the VIP package for the uh, Forza Motor, uh, what is it called? Forza Motorsport? Yeah, it's called Forza Motorsport. Sorry, forgot the name for a minute. You're going to get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. 19, 20, you get 20 cars on the uh, VIP package, so that's the premium. I think that's, um, yeah, that just dropped today, yep. What do I want to try? What do I want to break? Let's race, um, out of all these cars, we should be race. That Porsche is sick. 911 GT3R. All right, we're in the GT3R. New, new car. You guys, these graphics are sick. Look at these graphics, guys. You can open the door, wow. Let's take a look at take a look at this new Corvette. What? You shouldn't go grocery shopping with this. Interior. Can you look at the interior? Wow. Look at the interior guys. Look at the detail in this game. Crazy. Wow, very cool. So you can get in the car and look at it. Take a look on the outside. Very good graphics. But I think I'm going to take out this Porsche. All right. Free play. Quick event. Take a car, take a track, go race if that's the way to get on track. Any race you can imagine, shoot from those events. Time the race. The 
place for the car, babe. You car, return to my car, it's racing free play. Oh, what am I doing? You can sell your cars, that's crazy. Upgrading tune, design, and paint. So you could choose vinyl. Alright, so you could do all that customizing stuff like you can in all the other games, but I'm not going to get into that right now. Let's do something real quick though. Let's go to, uh, let's go to Turn of My Cars. What do I got that's kind of stock? What do I want to customize? Right, let's customize this. Upgrade in tune, design, and paint. Find design, split car, create a vinyl paint car. What can you buy parts at though? Performance, tuning, setup, split car, performance. Put an exhaust on it. Exhaust on it, put an air filter on it. We're gonna put an intake manifold on it. So I guess we gotta unlock this stuff. Brakes, this car needs some brakes. The brakes on this car suck. You can do so much in this. Very technical. You already know the best parts are the most expensive ones. Oh, you change the wheels? Okay. Your car 
section looks like. Um, let me switch back to that car. I don't know why I keep getting here. Okay, place in car bay. Place in car bay. If you want to show off your favorite cars, just assign them to a car bay. Oh, that's them pretty cool. You like. Put that up there. I want to put that in one. What's that? Play the track. New feature rivals. Who's in the show? Jump to multiplayer. So this is for the most part. Uh, find events. We have the track tour. Race an iconic track. Set your fastest lap times. Jump to multiplayer, and then yeah, see what's in the show. Expand your garage with privilege cars from the showroom. Save your hard earned credits and acquire spotlight cars at a limited time discount. Welcome to the showroom. Here you'll find hundreds of cars by dozens of manufacturers. I told you gonna buy that Viper. Oh, that's sick. Look at these cars. Some really cool cars in this game. You can just choose by make. Okay. Look at this. So many cars in this game. What? Should I get a Bugatti? Oh, should I get a Bugatti? Ah, man. I could buy it. I could buy the Bugatti if I wanted. Yeah, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait and see. I don't wanna waste my credits yet. Who knows? knows so many parts all right let's put a multiplayer though like I've been saying for an hour now what's new and then let's go to jump in a multiplayer in featured multiplayer you'll have the opportunity to compete at the international level against some of the best drivers in the sport it will take 100% focus and practice and qualifying for us to have any chance at success on race. Welcome all to the feature multiplayer. Come um, few drivers from around the world. We'll schedule events, complete three events, barker, qualifier series to unlock. All right, let's give it a shot. just came out so I think everyone online is gonna be a uh, well it's not necessarily true I was gonna say I think everyone's gonna suck online but I'm sure a lot of people played the other Forza's I'm new to Forza so don't judge me guys cut me some slack I'm not ready for this online mode yet if you see a cloud of dust ahead during the race from a car that's gone off Prepare for deteriorating traction from that sand pulled onto the track. Alright, let's go. 
Um, you practice one race and qualify. chances of starting near the front of the pack. Our starting position for today's race will be determined by how our qualifying lap time compares to the rest of the field. We don't get to practice. Let's go. We'll have a limited number of laps to spin in our best time. The faster the time, the further up the grid will start, and the less travel we'll have to contest with on our way down to turn. This series you can't even just hop into a race on. We gotta qualify. Coming up, that's time coming up. 
Oh damn, that guy got 109. Nicely done. Currently P2 after qualifying. All right. We're qualified. Zero. Oh, come on. I got like 14 minutes for a race to start. I gotta really wait 14 minutes. That's, I don't like that about this. I'm not liking that. I'm ready to go. I don't, got, I don't got nothing to do. Let's go. Let's race. Yeah, I'm not waiting that long. Alright, guys. So that's basically online mode. Obviously, you get into a race after that, but I'm not waiting 14 minutes right now. It's actually 2.36 a.m., so I'm going to wrap this up. I just wanted to show you guys uh, a first sneak peek at what this game was like because it just came out a couple hours ago. At 12 o'clock, so it took me about an hour to download it. Um, you know what? Before I, before I, uh, before I exit out of this video, you know what I'll do? We shall go over to the go to um. What is the car pack? Okay, so I got 30 extra cars at one low price. What? Expand your Forza Most Sport Garage with 30 extra cars at one low price. Car pass delivers 30, <clears throat> 30 new two Forza cars to the game weekly, one per week for you, for you to collect, build and race. Pretty neat. Get five immediate car unlocks, bonus credits to help you acquire. This is just stuff I got for having the premium. All right, it's pretty cool. Um, wanted to go to buy cars real quick though. What is the best car in the game? I wonder. Bugatti guys. Just got the Bugatti. Oh. Alright, let's go test it out real quick before I get off this before we end this video. secured you unlimited access to the biggest collection of cars on earth and the best tracks to race them on. Set your race rules or run with no rules at all. Better buckle up though. The action is going to be intense. All right, now let's test out the Bugatti. One quick race in the Bugatti. 
Kayalami sits at over 5,000 feet above sea level. So, naturally aspirated engines can expect some power loss due to the thinner air. faster than the Mustang. I don't really use the rewind on crew. It's 
definitely something I used a lot more on this game. I still almost missed that corner. Ow. that's it I'm gonna close out this video it is 248 in the morning so um, you guys seen it here it's the uh, uh, motor fest Forza motor motor fest um, premium edition and uh, it's just got released today so hope you guys enjoy my video and I'll see you guys next time <laughs>